It's been five years since a park in Patterson's sixth ward has seen a major renewal. One, two, three, six ward! That drought ends today. Today's a, a big, big win. A great day for the city of Patterson and the sixth ward. The overgrown grass, standing water, and rogue ivy growing in the dugouts of the baseball field behind School 25 will soon be part of its past, replaced with new grass, clay, and backstops. Speaking of the past, the field has a rich history. Just ask Congressman Bill Pascrell, who first played on this field in 1948. I was 11 years old. And we played the first major league game here. And I played a lot of ball here. This is why I got my start in baseball, right on, that, right on this field. And Mayor Andre Sea recalls hitting his first and only home run of his Little League career here. It hit the top of the fence and bounced over onto the other side. So thankfully, it cleared and it was considered a home run. <laughs> but today we had a home run for the students here at School 25 for the youth here in the neighborhood, our Lakeview neighborhood. It's thanks to a quarter million dollar donation from Bergen County philanthropist Marilyn Clark, who's donated almost a million dollars to fixing Patterson's ball fields, including Lester Titus Field in February. Marilyn Clark just took interest in our city, has taken interest in our city for quite some time, but wanted to make a significant investment towards improving the quality of life for residents in Patterson. In case you haven't been able to tell by now, the city of Patterson has an affinity for fixing up ballparks. This is the 10th park the city's revitalized in the last five years, and more are on the way. And we're trying to revive popularity in what was once our national pastime. The field is set to be ready for game time by the end of August. In Patterson, Jim Vassell, Pix 11 News.